Welcome back to another video. Uh, today we have the Tech Life Power Tools Reciprocating Saw. This is the one-handed reciprocating saw. Um, it looks like it's uh, 20 volts. We'll see um, what it is. So we got DRS01A. Big shout out to Tech Life for sending us this item, this uh, reciprocating one-handed reciprocating saw. So we can test, see if it works, see if it doesn't for you guys. So don't forget to help out the channel by subscribing, hitting the like, hitting the bell icon, so we can buy more tools like this, make more tool review videos. That's the way YouTube rests the platform by subscribers and likes. So help us out by subscribing and do, uh, hitting the like. So telephone number, um, Shenzhen Tech Tools Company, Tech Life. If you guys don't know what uh, who Tech Life is, Tech Life is pretty much the um, the brand, the Amazon brand. That they sell they sell pretty good quality uh, tools mostly diy type of tools all right first thing out of the box um looks like uh looks like we have a guard you have a branch here and you want to you can pretty much put the guard here and it'll protect the it'll protect you from moving this so it'll it'll grip it pretty much a blade this looks like a metal blade uh, judging from the tooth so um, let's see we got 157 millimeter uh, 6 inch 18 tpi by metal uh, this is a wood blade judging from the teeth um, it says fast rough cut for wood tech life we have a charger pretty basic you got plus and minus obviously you're not gonna you don't have to worry about that you just have to put the battery you got a red and a and a green maybe uh charging and charged uh green obviously you got um some mounts you can mount this on your garage maybe in your wall and stuff like that it does give you the measurements it's really nice to have put a couple of screws in the wall and just hang this looks like a battery So we got a nice a T power, 20 volt max, two amp hour line battery by Tech Life. So we got a pretty nice little logo here. We got some nice rubber stop. So all this uh, orange is uh, rubber. Uh, we got three bars. Uh, we got a total of four bars. So it only has three bars currently. Um, that's the bottom. It's all nice uh, rubber uh, overmold. Uh, you guys uh, says lithium ion model number TK2020, uh, 20 volt max, uh, 40 watt hours, made in China. Got some uh, basic connectors there, and we do have a nice release. Next item we have, we got some instructions. We got a nice one-handed reciprocating saw, so it does have a lock on. Immediately, I um, so you can't press it here. You gotta have to press this lock to unlock it. This does have a uh, rubber. All this um, is rubber. This is plastic. Uh, this is rubber. It does have a nice rubber. Same thing with this. Um, this if you want to put your hand here, like so, get some more grip. You got um, a speed selector on the back never seen a speed selector but uh, on a tool like this but um, you do have uh, 126 so this is a reciprocating saw uh, DRS 01A 20 volt max stroke length uh, 20 millimeters no load speed 0 to 3000 rpm it says cutting depth steel 6 millimeters wood uh, 100 millimeters it says uh, 20 volt max on the side there it does have a lock Oh, so I oh, so you, if you want to lock this a shoe here, it's uh, so um, the shoe it's not adjustable. You can twist this like so, maybe to release and to accept the, the blade. So uh, let's see here. All right, so that's pretty much how it goes. You you twist this part. You twist this part and then you insert the blade like so all 
it does have a work light here so you guys see um, some nice LED lights so you do have a nice LED there so you guys see there locks in place and then you're ready to make your cut you can put your um, all this dust tilt back in case you you're done with the cut and it tilts back and then you do have the release here we're gonna put the tool by itself it weighs two pounds ten ounces the battery by itself, it's a 2 amp hour battery, it weighs 14.1 uh, ounces. The tool with the battery, it weighs 3 pounds, 8.6 or 8.5 ounces. Tool measurement, as in tall, you got about uh, 13 and a half, 2 and a half I would say, as in long, standing up, total with the shoe. I'll say about seven and a quarter. Overall, I think this item is this little saw is very powerful for smaller stuff for light duty pruning. And as you guys see here, um, you guys don't want to pull out your uh, your saw manual saw. You can pull this out, have it cut in a in a, in a you know pretty pretty fast. Um, if you got a small piece of metal, maybe a, a pipe or a copper or whatnot. You guys can cut with this. This will be fine. Um, definitely recommend it for the DIY, for the home use. Definitely a great item. Don't forget to help out the channel by subscribing, hitting the like, hitting the bell icon, so we can buy more tools like this, make better review videos. That's the way YouTube as a platform by subscribers and likes. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching.